On February 7, Huntington University's JMC hosted the third blood drive of the year for the American Red Cross Association. The drive was held in the upper level of the Habaker Dining Commons from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Grace McBrayer, the Director of Volunteer Service and Outreach Ministry, believes the blood drive is an important way to serve others. Uh, the Red Cross always has, I mean, there is a constant need because um, the use of blood is ongoing. And so that's why we do four a year, and that's why we, um, we give to them. It helps save lives, and, you know, it's part of giving back to our community. JMC had a goal to donate 84 pints of blood, but only 59 were collected. Overall, 70 people showed up to donate blood, including 12 walk-ins. But everyone must pass a screening test first, and 12 people were deferred because of inadequate test results to give blood. I'm giving blood because it's, it's really not that hard to do. It's simple, and I feel like that the prick on my arm could save someone's life, so I feel like I'm obligated to do it. The Red Cross collected five double red donations, meaning that five people produced double the amount of blood normally collected. Uh, I like to help save lives, and this is a really easy way of doing it. So, yeah. Some students who did not donate still volunteer their time to welcome and direct donators. Wednesdays are light for me, so I can I have time, and so I figured might as well come out. According to RedCross.org, every minute of every day, someone needs blood. Currently, only three out of every 100 people in America donate blood. JMC plans to have another blood drive in April. For more information, stop by the JMC office in the Hub or visit their Facebook and Twitter pages. For the Huntingtonian, this is Jared Huda.